Hello, people. I am playing Rivals of Ether. I'm just playing to show off this glorious mod. This Mario is like absolutely insane. The costumes are insane. The movesets coded. I just like I got this a few days ago, and I've already played like a couple hours. And I'm not like super into fighting games, but man, I think just the satisfaction or like it's satisfying, you know, game to play as Mario, obviously. But just the speed of it is, oh, it's so different. I might show off the other mods I have, because I got some pretty good ones, and I've gotten decent with a few of them. But in general, this is the mod I want to show off. So maybe I'll do separate videos for each mod I want to show off. I'm like trying to be one of those YouTubers. Ah! As you see, like obviously I use the workshop for a lot of my stages I like playing. I prefer playing a lot of these. Though sadly, they all have cool like designs, but they all tend to be like, just flat ground with maybe a platform sometimes. Ah, man, that was good. And on a high note. Ah, ah. Sprite work is also like amazing. I love when there's like mods for games like this one where they make the sprites look like they're part of the game. Because there's a lot of mods that like uh, Sonic Mania mods, for example, with Mario. There are like none that actually make him look like he's part of the game except I think like one. And that's not finished. What is so nice is so many things can just combo into each other. Which I mean, that's probably not a Mario thing, that's more of a Rivals of Ether thing. Which, you know, honestly, so satisfying. They like are very good at reading when I'm preparing. It's actually impressive. Okay, that kind of looked clean. That looked a little clean. What I also like about this game is it feels like any move that's like super easy to combo it doesn't do that much percentage so like it feels like i could combo but like i can't just like get away with racking up like a crap ton of damage on them yeah when it comes to mod characters like i don't have as many just because like i only try to keep the ones that i know i'm gonna play as like they don't take that much space but you know you want to still have some space on your laptop especially with how many steam games i own it's like 30. i find this very interesting i found this one it's like a Lego Sonic and Cyber Lego Sonic Cyberspace Seems like an interesting thing to make instead of just making you know cyberspace, but I mean what would cyberspace be? Oh, it's sky sanctuary So I mean giving it some uniqueness is always cool. There are certain characters of the uh, Rivals of ether like cast like that. I kind of struggle with uh, This girl is definitely one of them the guy with the towel and a Shovel Knight sometimes can be a pain in my bum yeah! Alright, we back home. Alright, we take those. Alright, one more stock. Oh, man, I, I'm gonna be honest, I got a little desperate on that. Does it matter? Let's go! Oh, gotta do, gotta do the Super Mario 63 one. No, the towel! This is the towel dude I was talking about. Yes, sir! Finally got a parry. I had to get one in this video. Eee. All right. See, there's moments like this where I'm like, "Oh, crud!" And then you realize, "Oh wait, I have a whole more stock than he does." Oh, did I mean what I meant to, kid? All right, not one stock lost. See, I'm sorry. I'm really like I cook with Mario. I really do. Oh, baby! Now, if only I could do that in actual Smash. That's out of the park. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have done him so dirty. Let's go, baby. With this one in the Super Luigi World skin, they worked perfectly because those sprites back in the day were uh, the were shaped like Mario. So technically, I am playing as Luigi right now. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I. Let's go, baby! So like the long jump and slash dive do have a hitbox, but it's very small, which I think is fair. Considering like, it is like more recovery based or uh, movement based, I guess is the way to put it. Oh, read him like a book. Oh, I was gonna go for some sauce. Yeah. And what's cool 
is the sprite work is more based off uh, that phone version of Sonic Unleashed, which I guess makes sense, but, you know, it's so cool to see. Like, I'm pretty sure the remixes they even use are the ones from the phone game. I still don't know what these things do, honestly, that are around me when he hits me with it. Dude, the evil... That's what it does?! That is actually super cool. <laughs> I probably shouldn't talk so much before it comes back to bite me in the butt. Game design is so peak. Come on, buddy, come back. What, what's taking you so long? Dude, the spacing between these fireballs is what's like so too perfect about it. This is honestly evil. I just like hit the money spot. <laughs> All right, can't wait to fast forward this part and see how long it goes on for. No! <laughs> I was like, are we doing this again? Oh, that's gone. That's gone! See, I feel like usually these Rivals of Ether videos are like about like funnier mods or stuff, but I'm sorry, this mod has just been so good to me. I don't even know when it was released, but I just knew it had to get, it had to get some uh, video. Does not matter how popular my channel is. <laughs> Oh, that almost went with the hey! It might have. I'll have to replay. Woohoo! Let's go, baby! Yeah, this one's definitely a lot more dynamic. Okay, both times I've played this stage, I've gotten terminal velocity. Why am I not getting Planet Wisp? I do like that a lot of these do have like multiple songs, but also I kind of want to play them with their music. Like Metal Harbor, I have a Metal Harbor one that plays in Escape from the City and Live and Learn, as long with Metal Harbor and like Green Force and stuff, but like, nah, I'm not here for Metal Harbor. I mean, I am here for Metal Harbor, not Live and Learn and Escape from the City. Where are you at? That's gone! <laughs> no way! There's no like actual spikes, it's more like, well, there is, but it's the most high risk, high reward spike ever. But I don't know, I think with how how good Mario's moveset is here, his spike being harder to like fully achieve, I think is fair. And <laughs> I mean that one can be a spike if you're low enough. Yeah, see this one's just a box, but you know, it's got the aesthetic of the goat, so that just makes it infinitely better. What'd you expect? Rat lady. There she is! Yes! I finally got a that's the second one I've gotten with the triple jump kill. And like, I, I only think you bow if you get a kill with it, so it's like, pretty satisfying. Okay, I'm fine dying like that. That was just a lot of good percentage. Oh my word, you just need- YOU NEED TO GO KID! And she's GONE! As you can see, there's like the different aesthetics in the back. Like we got Mario World, Mario DS, and then we're on Mario 1. And it like switches in between. It's so cool. Oh, I just noticed. I thought the background changed with it. I guess it doesn't. Kind of a bummer. But you know, you can only do so much. All right, we'll take it. No, this is definitely the best Mario stage I've seen out there though. It's like, it's not like super dynamic and amazing. It's just a simple stage, but it has the best aesthetic. And it's definitely the most creative. Not like dogging anyone else's, or like just complimenting this one higher above the rest. See, for one, I love the aesthetic of this game land. And it looks, see, I also, uh, it just looks like it's just a flat stage. And it's like, nope. It's just a longer stage, which I think is something I like too. I'm sorry. I am sorry in advance. Oh, I was going for the uh, down smash. There it is. Do I bow? I don't! You only bow if you get the kill, that's awesome. You know, it's like that little extra cherry on top for actually getting a kill with it. I really jumped into that one, didn't I? Man. I want it! Oh, okay. I guess that's fine. I'm sorry, this this song and stage just feels so Mario. Just to me, I guess. Because, or like, I feel like it could work in Mario. I don't know about that song entirely, but I feel like it, I feel like it could. I mean, wow, Plant Kingdom with all of its mushrooms, Mario, crazy. Oh man, ha ha ha! Oh, I fumbled it immediately. Woo! 
So the first one I had 8%, the second one I had 32. Let's see how we end this final stock on. I just realized, okay, so wait, this, whatever his name, like, wolf guy, can use that thing to come back to me? And, okay, I ended on 69%. Oh, that ending was just a little too amazing. <laughs> Get this Mario instant, because he is so good. Uh, I, I'll probably make another one of these, honestly, I love this game so much. But until then, I'll see you on the next video.